Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm looking for new. So this video is one of the many I have about praying and how to pray effectively. So let's get straight into it, shall we? Shall we? Subscribe, hit the bell, give a like, a thumbs up, and I get into it. Pray. But don't pray haphazardly. Don't pray casually. Without intentionality. Pray in alignment with the truth of God, with God's word. Now, this takes action. It takes concentration. It takes forethought. It takes intentionality to make sure that you know what, prom what God's promises are so that you can line yourself up, your prayers up with God's word and what he said. To pray, pray from the spirit, pray from your heart, pray from your heart to God's heart. To pray effectively, you have to pray, to pray through the spirit and therefore you need the Holy Spirit. And the only way you're going to get the Holy Spirit is when you give your life to Jesus. He'll give you the Holy Spirit, the salvation. Salvation because the Holy Spirit is the same spirit that God rose Jesus from the dead. And the only way to get that is the only way to get to heaven. How would you get to heaven, you may say? Very simple. Jesus. See, for God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son, Jesus Christ, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. And we say, like, okay, what's Jesus for? Jesus is that barrier. So... God is perfect and he's in heaven and there's no sin in heaven. We're sinners. Why are we sinners? How are we sinners? You're a sinner. Have you ever lied? Have you ever stolen? Have you ever cursed or said God's name in vain? That's a sin. So we can never be perfect. We can never get to heaven on our own. So God knew that and he knew he had to send someone or something. Therefore, he sent Jesus down to earth for us. So he sent Jesus to break that barrier so that he died on the cross for your sins and for mine. That's John 3, 16. The gospel. It's the good news. That all we have to do is go to Jesus and with a childlike um, understanding, we have to admit, believe in your heart that God rose Jesus from the dead and declare with your mouth, therefore, you convince, be convinced in your mind, therefore, uh, confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord and you will be saved. So, you just need to go to the cross, you need to go to Jesus, the childlike, the childlike faith, and say, Dear Lord, I know that I'm a sinner. But I believe that you died for me and I believe that you rose again. I hail you as Lord. I repent of my sins. I give you my life. I trust you, Jesus. I ask you, Lord, to save me. Thank you, Lord, for saving me in Jesus' name again. Amen. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man comes to the Father except through me. It's by grace we're saved through our faith in Jesus. The day you become saved is the day you become a citizen of heaven. It's the only way you're going to get to heaven. And Jesus is coming back so soon. Thank you guys so much for watching. And see you in the next video. Bye guys.